on the search for a place to finally play Major League Soccer in Miami, Inter-Miami FC, hoping to kick off next year, but a permanent stadium still many years away. One of the few options for a temporary stadium taken off the table today. So tonight the team is still homeless and time is running out for a solution. CBS 4's Hank Tester live on the campus of FIU, which may just come into play here, right Hank? That's exactly true. Now, Elliot, you remember all the different locations that David Beckham went through looking for a stadium, a site. One didn't make it. This one didn't make it. And finally, Mel Reese might be part of the uh, equation. But for a period of time, going into the uh, soccer year 2020, he's going to have to find a temporary home. And, uh, boy, he's having a tough time doing it. Let's take a look. Major League Soccer coming to Miami has never been short of drama and long on arrival. The latest, no place to play. Sure, big plans, but local government hoops to jump through. The voter approved soccer complex, Mel Reese Golf Course, not ready until 2021, if all falls into place. Meanwhile, where to play when Inter Miami joins its first MLS season? A temporary home seems hard to come by. Well, there's Marlins Park. Some soccer's been played there in the past, but the MLS season overlaps the Major League Baseball season, and soccer chews up the field. Not good for baseball. Our news partners, the Miami Herald, report the Marlins stance is it's not a good fit for us. Well, how about Hard Rock Stadium? Lukewarm reception at best, maybe a game or so could be played there, but not a temporary home because of the MLS season conflicts with the Dolphins and the University of Miami football season. And then there's the new tennis complex at the Hard Rock, which will house the Miami Open tennis tournament. Homeless for sure, but word is talks are going on for the team to locate 2020 operations at FIU's Ricardo Silva Stadium, which is kind of symbolic of the Inter-Miami MLS saga, because it was here June 1st, 2013, when David Beckham made a visit to the FIU facility, got the grand tour and even a key to the county from Mayor Carlos Jimenez. Beckham would go on to seek a stadium site he lost out on many of those, and years later, still looking for a home for his first season in Major League Soccer. Well, we reached out to Jorge Moss today. He was unable to get back to us. Now, a statement released by Ricardo Silva, the stadium here named for him, basically saying, we support our friends at Inter Miami, but we aren't in a position. We are not in a position to comment on rumors about any discussions about FIU. So, here we go. It's the very latest. I'm Hank Tester, CBS4 News. Back to you.